<laughs> Wait, I forgot. Who the hell is pregnant? What? I found a pregnancy test at your cabin and I checked with all the girls over there. It wasn't any of them. Hello, darling. What a surprise. Hey, can we talk maybe in private? You and me? I believe she's referring to me, son. Please excuse us. <clears throat> so, I uh, am pregnant. I see. I don't understand how. We were so careful. I warned you about this. Standard birth control methods aren't usually effective against a Swanson. I got about a million thoughts running around my head. But I really just want to know what you're thinking. Okay, here's what I'm thinking. I was gonna wait until our anniversary, take you somewhere romantic, perhaps in a canoe, most likely in a canoe. I actually built a canoe for that purpose. But given the news, and given my significant feelings for you, now seems as good a time as any. Ron Swanson. Diane Lewis. Will you marry me? Yes. On one condition. Anything, my love. Ask me for anything in the world and I'll give it to you. Except a destination wedding. Just the opposite. We've both been married before. I don't want anything big or elaborate. In fact, the smaller the better. I assume you can deal with that. <laughs> Are you kidding? As far as I'm concerned, we could go up to the fourth floor right now. Hey, Leslie, what's with the getup? We're coming back from uh, cleaning up a Pawnee River. There's nothing I love more than squeegeeing slime off a highway underpass. Where are you guys going? The fourth floor, getting married. Okie dokie, well, catch you later. What? What? Oh, what? What tattoos? What the? Are you dead? You look like you're in rictus. I just, I'm having so many thoughts and feelings that I'm paralyzed right now. Peralta, looks like an old friend of yours is back in town. Who? That guy, Neil, that you bunked with at sleepaway camp? Ah, uh, Neil from camp was the best. He could pick up a milk carton with his butt cheeks. <laughs> he was so funny. You know who else was funny? Bill Cosby. Charles, will you relax? You're gonna love Neil. It's not Neil. Why would it be Neil? It's Doug Judy. Oh, right. Someone we all know in a police capacity. That makes more sense. Someone's using his signature move to steal cars, plugging into the OBD port and reprogramming the immobilizer module. That's Doug Judy's M.O., but it's not him. He told me he went legit. That's what he told you last time, too, before he screwed you over. Yeah, but he returned the diamonds to me eventually, and it turned out that was the only way to get Giggle Pig off the streets. Wait, I may be confusing our adventures. What year was the cruise? The dude's a criminal. People don't change. Ever heard of Bruce Banner, the Incredible Hulk. You might want to talk to his shirts and pants about people not changing. <laughs> well, I want to ask Doug Judy some questions. You have his number? I always make contact through his mom. I'll put you in touch with her, but remember, she thinks I'm his assistant, Mangy Carl, and he's a famous architect who's designing LeBron James's new school for black astronauts. Hello, Mrs. Judy? I'm looking for your son, the architect. Yes, I'm from black NASA. Oh, my. I didn't know. I understand. Goodbye. So, Doug Judy will not be coming in. What? Why not? Oh, I see. He is dead. Actually, it's kind of too bad we're not coming into work tomorrow. Why? I bet Michael had some elaborate theme party planned, like scrambled eggs Saturday. <laughs> More like, hey, everyone, let's get your boss laid Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> I have an announcement uh, to make. I am moving to Costa Rica. Thought about it for a long time now, and I'm finally gonna do it. So, I'm just gonna hop the fence and jog home now. Where's Captain Holt? Who's Captain Holt? I don't know Captain Holt. What? NYPD, put down your weapons! What the hell? 
What is happening? We're at the wrong bank. Uh, I'm crashing. We're NYPD officers. This is an undercover operation. That's a lie, Peralta. You're the golden gang. We've been on to you for weeks, but we finally got you. Hawkins? How did you get over there? Who are they? You tell me. They're your crew. They got us, Jake. It's over. I've never seen them before. What is going on? Good job, everyone. We finally got the golden gang. I can't believe you thought you were gonna take me down. You are not gonna get away with this. Oh, I already did. And Captain Holt won't be able to get you out of this one. Get them out of my sight. Dirty cops make me sick. They make me sick. I'm the sick one. She's dirty. I'm clean. Give it up for... Girls, back up! Ah! 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 Oh, thank you so much. We're gonna start fresh, take a couple new steps, and wear our comfortable shoes. Look at our history, there is no mystery, the problem here was you. Take off the filter from the photograph, and look who it is you see. It isn't perfect, so what's wrong with that? The best things in life are free. So what if we risk it all and try, knowing we might fall, but we might fly? Who cares what they say? We're gonna do it our way, like Sinatra or Burger King. Five stars. Speaker Stinker. Stinker. Stinky. You'll be on in just a few after we get these ladies cleared off. Oh, no, no, no. What I'm saying? Sneaking on stage, that's a little stinker move right there. Let him rock. Everybody, so how are we going to energize our office. I mean, I haven't done anything since Christmas. Pam clearly has just given up trying. So what we need to do is we need to get things going. We need to get percolating a little bit. Anybody have any ideas what we could do? Any suggestions? Yes, Andy. What if we changed our outgoing answering machine message so it just had a little more zing and a little more pep? Zing and pep. See, that's, those are the kind of words we're looking for. Yes, Jim. What about if we did an even newer voicemail message that had even more zing and pep? Now we're cooking. I like this. Maybe a whole theme, like a rap, a rap rhyme. An urban thing. An urban, yeah. Stanley, you want to help us out with that? Stanley, Earth is Stanley. Not me. Yes, you. Come on, Stanley. Put your little game down and, and join the group. No. Stanley, we're do having a little Leave brain me alone, we're damn having it. a brainstorm session. Did I stutter? Good, this is good. I'm going to grab a glass of water. 